Hello wonderful viewer, this is Jesus Baby TV Family Talk Show. My name is Faith Abu and with me here are beautiful people, wonderful people, people with good intellect, people who are experts and professionals in their various fields. But today we will be discussing a very important issue, a very very important issue that is heart piercing. And the topic on ground here is why do some African women find it very difficult to mourn their husband. But before we proceed, I would like to give them, I would like to give my analysts the opportunity to introduce themselves. For my left hand side, please. Thank you, viewers. My name is Godwin Ago. My name is Moses Sukweba. You're welcome to the show. Moses. Thank you. My name is Chinyere Agu. Hello, everyone. My name is Rita Itamoroti. Thank you. Hello, viewers. My name is Obioma Dumei. Nice to have you all on the show. Before we continue, we'll be going on a very short break. So just sit, relax, and enjoy. Thank you. Welcome back. Still on the discussion. Why do some, we, some African women these days find it very difficult to mourn their husband? It really beats my imagination. Please, Moses, what do you have to say on this issue? Thank you, Marietta. Uh, really, it has become a very big problem in our society. Uh, these days, the churches have not really added value to the system. Gone are the old days when uh, women will mourn their husband. We find out that many homes now, they now begin to culture the modern civilization. They have dropped their culture. Our value system has been lost, has been left behind. You wonder why churches will be encouraging the women not to mourn their husband. I must confess to you, these are not really add value to our value system we all know as tradition. In my own place where I come from, in Idaho State, I find out that gone are the old days when the husband died, a woman will put on black clothes for a specific time. But gone are these days, you see a husband will die, the wife will not even care to put on these black clothes, and the churches. The so called husband will be going to one, the wife will be going to another church. They will not even care about the tradition. They will say, Let the tradition behind. Forget about it, not will happen to you. And let me tell you, if we don't go back to our source, you discover that a lot of things, I green growth, this young one that are coming up, will really go a wrong way. They will never really add value to the system. Thank you. So, are you trying to tell us? that churches are, churches are the reason why some African women these days find it difficult to mourn their husband. Please, God, what do you have to say? Um, thank you, Margaretto. I, mean, I cannot really say that 100% churches are causes because churches preach the Bible, and in the Bible, there are, uh, it is stated there in the Bible, people mourn their husbands in the Bible. There are so many of them, so many examples there. So I can only say that, but I can say that some of the reasons is this. Due to the present day modernization, our women, they have tended to imbibe the Western culture, dropping our own culture and tradition, forgetting that our tradition to be supreme. They will tell you these days that it doesn't matter. They want to build like the whites, forgetting that they don't share the same tradition, the same culture with those whites. So to them, it doesn't matter. But I can tell you here that it is not all women. So those few women that are doing that, that don't want to want their husbands, I can tell you vividly that they are possessed. Because it's only a possessed woman. Boring, boring. It's only a possessed boring. woman to come in can here. refuse to mourn the dead woman. Have, no, you at can't. least to give the dead woman is possessed. Because at that point, okay. you have to hear from her own side of the story. What side the woman of the story? Can, woman can only be possessed or at her guard. At that you, moment, you when you marry a man, can I just say that? You can't say the woman is possessed. You can't just say that she's possessed. Don't be possessed. Most things that we know men who want such a thing, they have no one to be who wants to be who wants the wife to mourn for him, who wants the family to mourn for him, to keep up to his responsibility. Which responsibility? He should keep up as gain for the household. Which responsibility? For example, when you go outside, you hear the man taking school fees for children, all that, when he comes to his own Can you imagine? Can you imagine? You have invested so much, you measure responsibility. You have invested so much on a woman. Open business for her, anesthetics, all sorts of things. You try to do that all. 
so that you can be useful to us. Even when you are gone, you will take care of the children. Such a woman will not be able to take over her responsibility and do this business you are putting that is as you have to start going to parties. Here and here, flaring up, up and down. And at the end of the day, you are telling me that the man is telling you not to. Can I come in? Can I come in? Can I come in? When you give a woman all sorts of things, can I come in? has feelings. When a man does sorts of things for the wife, I'm telling you, she'll be a wonderful woman, which you least expected. But when you don't do that, you are not available. Every time you are out there, you are not available. Is it when you start seeing women and coming in and sending policies? Because no. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. please, what do you have to say concerning the, the, this issue on ground? Like, can you help us with the factors and the reason why some women these days find it very difficult to mourn their husbands? Thank you, moderator. This is one of the reasons why I would say maybe some women find it very difficult today to mourn the death of their husband. You can imagine the husband that you marry, you said that you love yourself. The man now is dead. The, the first thing, the first day they went to even the cop is still on the ground. The one of the parents, maybe the mother of the father, or of the brother, or any of the uncle. We, the first thing that will come out from their mouth is that where is our husband's property? Where is our son's property? Asking for the property. Where the wife was still up the ground. And the children, how the document, how do they stand in? The first book of the man. The first book of the man. How would the woman feel? 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 But in fact, that responsible wife, responsible woman, regardless of what the, 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 the father-in-laws or the mother-in-laws are doing, should concentrate and give the dead man the respect okay, okay. he should have. Okay, but she is a responsible woman. We don't find it. So, we so, women are tender. Okay. There's some things you do that dramatize us. We when, you, when, when, a, when, a, when a family member asks us, how do you expect the woman to react? How do you expect her to have the time? I can still go to you that I have the time. How would I let you know that you are a woman? Why would you let her there? 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 That woman is a gold digger. It's only a part of what you get from the man. You can't say she's a woman. You can't say she's an English man. The behind the scenes of a woman, woman is only a woman. You forgot about the man. Look, if you say she's a woman, you are married traditionally. You can't say a woman is not a woman. You can't say a woman is not a woman. You can't say a woman is not a woman. The husband mother, what is running for ATM, can. You should observe that tradition and understand the debate. No matter what. At that moment, at that moment. Thank you. Um, Edna, please, do you agree with what Corbyn is saying? That women are gold diggers. Thank and that is the reason why they fail to mourn their husband. I disagree, moderator. Thank you. This is one of the reasons why women don't really mourn their husband these days. Number one, infidelity. Thank you. Number two, most of our men nowadays, they don't take care of their, they don't meet up to their responsibilities. They don't even take proper good care of their family. Which no responsibility? There's no one that takes care of their The world has gone by. Yeah, no, the world has gone by. It is not in the hands of the woman. Care for the woman. Care for the two men. 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 Care for the Imagine a man that married you as uh, his wife. You started uh, struggling with the man right from the first day. Maybe the man does not even have money to buy common, let me say, paracetamol. When you start giving birth, you give to the baby or even the mother. God now blesses the both of you. That is when the man now knows that. You, you are now an old woman. You will now have another to get another baby. She's outside. Let me know. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. You know. 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 You
As a man in the family, you are there for the family. Yeah. I don't see any woman, there's no woman. What she could have had to do is a man, she will submit and do everything for you.